Hi, I'm James A. Swan, and I want to tell you about my novel, LD50, which is set in the Pinky Finger area of Michigan's Lower Peninsula. Around beautiful sleeping bear dunes, eagles, hawks, foxes, bears, and other predators are dying in droves, and biologists are stumped. Some locals believe that the slaughter is a sign of an ancient Indian prophecy that the earth is out of balance. Proof of that theory, they say, is that Bigfoot is showing up and is wreaking havoc on farmers. U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service Special Agent Moses Molson, who is part Indian and some say part hawk, suspects a pesticide or toxic chemical, but he can't prove it. Moses needs help with his investigation, as special agents generally work alone, undercover, and are about as common as hooping cranes. For his backup, Moses draws on two unconventional allies. Fuse, a former army explosives expert hiding in the woods trying to heal a bad case of PTSD. And Charlie Wong, a multicultural shaman who heals man and nature with wisdom, magic, and spirits and sells organic fruits and vegetables in beautiful Sweetwater Valley. Things shift into high gear when a dying hawk leads Moses to save Monica Jankowski a.k.a. Monique Jouillet, from being raped. A burned-out Motown blues singer and animal rights activist, Monique embarks on a spiritual awakening when Charlie Wong takes a curse off her, and she reluctantly joins Moses' team. More and more birds and animals are dying, and then people begin dying in the same strange way. Moses and his team must conjure up a creative blend of ancient wisdom, modern science, and pure guts to stop a sociopathic multi-species serial killer. LD50 is now available in the ebook format from Amazon.com, Barnes & Noble, Smashwords, and just about every other online bookseller for $4.95. Do you know what an LD50 is?